than when they arrived earlier. The Mississippi River winding its way through Grind City. Welcome from Memphis, Tennessee. Welcome, everyone. What better way to end the weekend than the NBA on 2K Sports? Joined by Grant Hill, Steve Smith, and Allie LaForce. I'm Brian Anderson. Hey, Allie. Well, coming up, Damian Lillard wasn't the most touted. He said, quote, I know what it's like to not have the lights on you. I did my work behind the scenes, not certain if I'd ever get the results. I don't forget what it took for me to get here. The work, the discipline, the humility, and the compassion. I stay true to that. B.A.? Incredible. Thanks, Allie. Now let's check out the Western Conference standings and see how they look here in December. You look at Memphis, their efforts so far have put them fifth in the conference with plenty of time left to move up. And, of course, Portland back three games. Checking out Portland, I really think they've been hit and miss thus far. I mean, they are a playoff-level team, but are they championship-level? Probably not. This has been the thought all along. They have enough to compete night in and night out, but they're not taking four out of seven from a top team in this league. No way. So here's Portland's starting group. Joe Ingles is out there with Justice Winslow. Then it's Yusuf Nurkic. Then there's Damian Lillard. And it's Bledsoe in at the two spot. And for the Grizzlies, Morant and Brooks, the backcourt. Brandon Clark out there with Steven Adams. And it's Anderson in at the three. And some teams hitting rough patches here in the middle part of the season. Smitty, how many players-only meetings have you been a part of that made a difference? You know, a few. Those meetings are like calling a timeout on the season. Some can stop the bleeding, but for others, it's not enough. I like this play. Good teamwork. You don't want to force Morant to do everything himself. Pass to Nurkic. Back to Lillard. Shoots over Morant. Out of bounds. It'll be Memphis's ball. Here's Brooks. Against Sacramento, he was really on his game. And Nurkic with the block. Bletso against Clark. Pass to Nurkic. Beyond the arc. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Bletso. What vision from Bletso. A point who can score it and dish it. First quarter, just over a minute play. Moran against Lillard. It's stolen by Nurkic. To the paint. Here's Bledsoe. That shot off. Now Memphis takes it the other way. They put up a nice win against Sacramento last time out. Oh my, talk about mental toughness. The crowd was roaring against them. But they were able to focus and finish the task at hand. It was a terrific performance we got a chance to watch. They got into a nice rhythm and made smart adjustments along the way. And it's the Grizzlies with the ball. Outside Morant. Just a capable defender. For Nurkic, it's about being in position and using his length to contest shots. Ingles. And they'll keep possession. Doesn't go for him. Good D by Clark. One for five out there, but no worries. Just keep attacking. Morant, the pass to Adams. Fades away. Rebounded by Nurkic. Missed opportunity. It's a makeable shot for him. He just can't get it to go. Here's Ingles. And he makes it on the layup. Nice job by Ingles. Competes hard. Tough. He's a glue guy. He helps keep this team together. Here's Morant. He had a 21-point outing in their last game against the Kings in Sacramento. We also got to mention what he did on the defensive end. Racked up a number of steals, too. And again, Memphis no good. The Trailblazers have gone two of six from the floor. With the floater. And it's Winslow missing. Memphis trailing here. Inside. Clark, no good. 
And the Trailblazers shooting just about 29% so far. Not great. And of course, Canadian-born Brandon Clark grew up in Phoenix. He played at San Jose State, then transferred to Gonzaga. A few stops on his way to the association. Now here's Moran. So versatile on offense. Averaging around 23.5 points per contest. Winslow with a defensive effort. That's their plan to get him an opportunity to finish in tight. That's a miss they can live with. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Connects from downtown. And dual citizenship for Brandon Clark. Canadian and the U.S. That Canadian national team is looking to be a force. And don't forget, his father is Jamaican, so who knows? <laughs> Bottom line, he's got some options when it comes to international play. Timeout called. Memphis. They traveled to Portland last time they faced the Blazers and came away with a win. They flat out dominated the last time these teams squared off, particularly on the glass. They generated second chance opportunities on one end, preventing them on the other end. That was the story of the game. On the wing, Brooks, defended by Nurkic. Looking to win the drought. Nurkic with some nice D. There is the value of great rim protection without fouling, forcing the miss. And the shot goes. This is the thing about Ingles. He's got the size and the strength to play with physicality. Now here's Moran. Brooks outside. Good. And the setup by Moran. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. Portland leading. Now Lillard. He had 25 points in his last game. Pass to Winslow. Back to Lillard. Anderson pulls it down. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Morant, the pass to Adams. Outside for Brooks. And it's going to be a three-second call. Lillard against Moran. Pass to Bledsoe. Here's Winslow. From outside, off the mark. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. And it's Clark on the take. Soft touch off the glass. And that's just nasty right there, guys. He has a tremendous crossover. Lillard against Moran. Bledsoe outside. Portland again missing. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. Moran, the pass to Clark. Over Narkic. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. You know, we saw at Gonzaga, Brandon Clark led the nation in block shots and field goal percentage. Great two-way potential. And you know, Clark, in college, was his conference's defensive player of the year. A little undersized, Smitty, but his explosiveness is special. It is, B.A. He had over a 40-inch vertical at the NBA Combine, and he has great timing. And in today's game, his 6'8 size gives him versatility to guard multiple positions. No good on that one. Good on the second one. Portland has gone two of five from beyond the arc in the first quarter. Lillard with the ball. Scoring around 28 and a half points a game. A very talented offensive player. 
Well, Memphis shooting an unremarkable 30% on the first. And they'll get another chance. Pass to Moran. Back to Adams. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Damian Lillard picks one up. I mean, one of the hardest workers in the league. Adams has done a great job of refining his offensive skill set. Free throw, no good. So it comes up empty at the line. You know what I like about Steven Adams is his intangibles. He's enthusiastic, he's a leader by example, and he's a role model for the younger players. Incredible. I mean, high energy in transition. Just feeding the defense up the floor. And I just love it when the fast break results in a high percentage look. Not always the case these days. You want to talk loaded college teams? Eric Bledsoe played with some serious talent during his one year in school. Bledsoe went 18th overall in the 2010 draft. He was the fourth selection from his school. Now, John Waller went first overall, DeMarcus Cousins fifth, and Patrick Patterson 14th. I'm happy I never had to face that squad when I was in college. Here's Lillard. The Grizzlies making their last shot. It's Winslow on the wing. Ingles against Clark from nine feet out. That one off the back iron and out. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Lillard against Clark. Lillard into the lane. Lays it up and in on the nice reverse. Lillard's got his second bucket of the night. Oh, wow. What a dangerous move on that drive. I mean, when Dame is coming in strong, it is so tough to stop him. Morant, the pass to Clark. Outside for Brooks. Outside, Anderson. And finished off by Anderson. Getting himself to the rim, Anderson continually finds ways to impact the game. Bledsoe outside, back to Lillard. Takes it inside. Here's Winslow. Off target with the three. I don't know how many misses that is in a row, but I know it's ugly. One sign of a great playmaker hitting his man in stride. Portland calls timeout. They're moving on after the tough loss they took at the hands of the Hornets. Well, you know when your percentage from the field is in the low 30s, that means the game is not going your way. They couldn't hit a thing out there. With that awful shooting percentage, you will be lucky to win one game in this league. A big group substitution here for Memphis. Tillman's checked in for Clark. Williams comes in for Anderson. Melton, he's checked in for Brooks. And it's Jones in for Ja Morant. A big group substitution here for Portland. Littles checked in for Nurkic. Hart comes in for Winslow. Johnson, he's checked in for Bledsoe. And it's Smith in for Lillard. Can't get it to drop. For Memphis, they've got 6 of 14 in so far. Wow, potent offense. It's been fun to watch. <laughs> Just aggressive and effective. Taking it right to the defense. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. Now here's Smith. He's averaging about six points per game. Outside Hart. 
Pass to Smith. Down to five on the shot clock. Will it go? That shot is off. Some solid defense from Williams. Melton outside. The three ball. The shot no good. And the Trailblazers go on the other way now. Ingles passes to Smith. Adams grabs the miss. Adams has got six rebounds now in the game. It's stolen by Johnson. To the inside. Smith. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. Now here's Jones. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. The putback. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And the Grizzlies lead by two. Great anticipation off the missed shot. Oh, his timing was impeccable. Smith passes to Ingles. Oh, it's stolen by Adams. Melton with the ball. And Johnson picks him up defensively. Here's Williams. Adams up top. Pass to Melton. Launches it. Hart pulls it in. Well, Portland's shooting around 32% to begin this game. Driving to the basket. Oh, a rim-rattling two-handed jam! He makes the D look silly. <laughs> what an incredible move. Man, how about that finish right there? Not too bad. Johnson against Melton. Outside, Williams. Back to Melton. Ooh, stolen by Smith. And here comes the break. Little shot is good. And an important part of every team's game. A look at the hustle stats for Portland. Their aggressiveness on D has been the most glaring aspect of this game so far. They have the heat turned all the way up in this first half. The other thing that's been effective so far tonight is their fast break. A lot of points coming on the run. Here's Melton. Oh, and Johnson with a block. Adam shots good. No question who's in control of the board so far. Outside Johnson. Pass to Little. A minute and a half left now in the first quarter. Smith left side. And he converts the layup. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. One sixteen left in the first. Now here's Adams. Second chance effort. Can't connect from short range. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. That one drops for him. Very little resistance around the rim right now. That's the fifth straight bucket they've given up in the paint. There's 53 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Ooh, and Adam strong finish. He's a big target with long arms. Just throw it up there, and Steven Adams, he will go get it. Now here's Smith. He's averaging about six points per game. And there's a whistle. That goes on DeAnthony Melton. That's his first foul. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Baines checked in. Simons has checked in for Portland. Smith outside. Pass to Hart. Here's Simons. Six to shoot. He takes it in. Fires from deep. It's rebounded by Memphis. There's 18 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Here's Melton. No good with the finger roll. Smith right side. Comes up empty down low. He got it off in time. One quarter in the books. And it's been a close one. 
Trailblazers out in front, up by two. And the second quarter is on its way when we return. And with his elite shooting, Lillard can work off screens and come back to the ball. Sometimes, he says, that makes things a lot easier. Getting the ball later in possessions when the defense isn't so sharp. You know, usually at the beginning of a defensive possession is get over the first screen. You know, they, the energy is up. Um, they're interested. And usually at about 12 seconds, they're a little tired. Um, the interest goes down. Well, when you're guarding Damian Lillard, you can't let up for a second, Grant. Uh, and the Blazers, generally a methodical offense. Now, they don't mind using the clock and forcing the defense to cover for all 24. Some good action already in this one. But a fairly even matchup after this first quarter of play. And looking at what we've seen from the Trailblazers, what do you guys think? That's <laughs> simple. Offensively, they limited their turnovers. Defensively, they force turnovers. Winning the turnover battle here early on, and you see that reflected in the score. Here are the five. Portland has to start the second. We've got Dennis Smith. Joe Ingles is out there with Josh Hart. Then there's Anthony Simons, and it's Little in at the five. Now here's Hart. Pass to Simons. Right side, Ingles. And it's Tillman with a rebound. He looked just a little out of rhythm. He's still trying to establish consistency from there. Nurkic just checked in for Ingles. Quarter number two and about a minute in. Outside Jones. Up and over Smith. Jones misses. And the Trailblazers shooting just 37% in the game. And it's Simons penetrating. Looking at the modern game, Grant, what adjustments would you have to make in your game to thrive in the league today? Well, I would have worked more on developing the three-point shot. Back in the 90s, it was more about the mid-range game, uh, a la Michael Jordan. But these guys now, they live at the arc. And that's just not how we did it back in the day when I was playing. The first one falls. Brooks, he's checked in for Memphis. So he makes both from the line. Memphis trailing here. Here's Jones. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Just five to shoot. Pass to Bain. Uncovered. They grab their own miss. Jones misses. And so here's Portland. They've only given up two points this quarter. When this game is done, they'll be off to New Orleans as they take on the Pelicans. That'll be the second of two games on the road. Shots good by Hart. His nimbleness makes him a unique threat at the rim. We're now about two minutes into the second quarter. Here's Bain. 11 points for him last game against Sacramento. Pass to Brooks. Rebounded by Nurkic. Nurkic has got six rebounds now in the game. Out to the right wing. And here in the second quarter of action, just a hair under two and a half minutes play. Oh, Brooks with the steal. And the Grizzlies pushing it up now. Here's Williams. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. And you have to love the focus. He gets hit, but converts it anyway. 
Clark has checked in for Memphis. Ja Morant comes in for Jones. Winslow's checked in for Portland. Damian Lillard comes in for Smith. A little over two and a half minutes into the second. Lillard against Moran. Here's Simons. Got a piece of it. And up the court come the Grizzlies on the break. Here's Brooks. And he sinks that one. Hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Brooks has got five points. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for Memphis. They're doing a great job defensively down low. They've already racked up a lot of blocks. They've established an intimidation factor early in this one. I also like what they've done on the fast break in their first half tonight. They're taking it to them. And here's Morant. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the second quarter. Outside, Williams. Moran against Lillard. Clock at six. And it's Moran off the drive. And no good. Nurkic with some nice D. Outside Hart. And stolen by Clark. It's a one-on-one -on -one situation. Outside for Moran. Gets the three to fall. He has seven. Gotta honor Morant's three ball. He's more than capable of torching you from there. Lillard against Morant. Pass to Simons. And the rebound goes to the Grizzlies. Clark's got five rebounds tonight. Now Morant. Seven points in the game. And then Morant with the jam! As creative as they come, John Moran has a style that's specifically his. And we've got to see that sensational mobile one block again. You know, you can't ask for any better defense than that. He responded so fast to the shooter and it stifled him. Now here's Lillard. Seven points in the game. Nurkic with the ball. Pass to Hart. Just five on the clock. Some solid defense from Williams. And here's Memphis. They're on a 10-2 run here. You know, Josh Hart won't wow you with the scoring or flashy plays. But he does all the little things for his teams. A 6-5 wing. Hart was one of the best rebounders in the league in the 2021 season. That number really jumps out at you for someone his height. one falls for him. Now when we talk about Hart, Smitty, he's been underrated it seems from the moment he entered the league. You're right, B.A. Playing four years in college, he was the final pick of the 2017 first round. What a value pick that's turned out to be. Jason's outperformed a bunch of guys who went in the top ten. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Anderson's checked in, and that's good as he hits both shots. What makes Dylan Brooks especially valuable to a team He's a competitor who you can count on to produce in the clutch. Bledsoe finds Nurkic. Here's Lillard. And that one good. Lillard's got four points now in the quarter. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Now here's Moran. He's got nine. Pass to Anderson. Here's Bain. Winslow defending. Here's Moran. And another miss by Memphis. Portland trailing here. 
They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Well, that was clearly a foul. First one at the line is good. Adams checked in for Bain. And also a switch here for Portland. Johnson's checked in. That one falls, so he hits both of them. And they seem to have taken a more heads-on approach this quarter. <laughs> and it's getting them to the free throw line. Brooks the pass to Anderson. And here's Adams. Now here's Clark. Adams finds Clark. Damn, that one's good. Clark's got five. You like how Adams surveys the whole floor, allowing him to spot the wide open band. Out to the wing from deep. Johnson. Clark grabs the board. Clark's got seven rebounds in the game. Brooks outside. Step back and fire, and he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Now it's a six-point Memphis lead. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? The three, here's Lillard, and it's good. Assisting on the play was Bledsoe. Bledsoe's got his third assist of the night. Nurkic against Moran. And it's Portland with a rebound. Nurkic has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. His inability to make shots has not brought this team down. That shows you their resourcefulness. Grant, it's hard not to be impressed by the sheer athleticism of Keon Johnson. Oh, yeah, he uses it fearlessly, B.A. He's not shy about going hard at the inside. You just love to see that kind of tenacity in a young player. misses and he sinks the second here's Morant he's got nine Down low. Here's Adams. No stopping him there. Jams it in. And he's fouled. An opportunity in a three-point play. That's on Justice Winslow. Ingles, he's checked in for Portland. And that one misses. Outside for Moran. To the middle. Here's Adams. Good. And the setup by Moran. Moran's got three assists tonight. Took him a while to get going, but here in the second quarter, he's found his rhythm. And here's Lillard. He's got 12. To the paint. Here's Bledsoe. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Bledsoe's got seven points in the game. You don't see guards with Bledsoe's strength too often. Part of what makes him so unique. Outside, Anderson. 
Pass to Adams. Brooks outside. Fires the three. Offensive rebound. Part of why they have this lead, they're doing the little things out there. The Trailblazers have gotten five of their first 11 shots to fall here in the second quarter. Pass to Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard! You expect big numbers from Lillard on offense. His productive habits always seem to pay off. Memphis leading. Now Morant. He's got nine. Over Lillard. Ooh, and Adam strong finish. <laughs> and B.A., he takes his rebounding so seriously. This dude is such a grinder. His teammates appreciate the effort. Just goes all out on the glass. You know, this is one of his specialties, keeping plays alive, creating second chance opportunities. Get that weak stuff out of here. That's embarrassing. Oh, Clark with the slam. With the ball in his hands, Ja draws so much defensive attention. Got his teammate a clean look. Bledsoe against Brooks. Outside Winslow. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. He played well in the first quarter, but now he's taking it to the next level. Timeout called. Memphis. And the 6'6 forward Justice Winslow drafted 10th in the 2015 draft. I mean, he's a strong body defender, and he loves to make winning plays. And the Grizzlies with some changes. Tillman's checked in for Clark, and it's Melton in for Brooks. And also a switch here for Portland. Littles checked in for Winslow. Lillard against Morant. Banked it in off the glass. Morant's got 11 points. And you know Grant Winslow battling some injuries in recent years. When healthy, he is definitely a difference maker. I mean, I love that he's a gritty defender who's also an outstanding passer. Now, his scoring has lagged behind a little bit, but nevertheless, he sets the tone with his effort and attention to detail. Memphis has gone one of three from three-point land here in the second quarter. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. And now a 10-point Memphis lead. The playmaking ability of Kyle Anderson combines great floor vision with his height and feel. Inside, Lillard. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Bledsoe. Bledsoe's got his fifth assist in this one. Memphis has gone two of four from beyond the arc in the second quarter. Goes up at the strike. Rebound by the Trailblazers. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. One fourteen left in the first half. Pass to Bledsoe. The three is up. And again, it's Portland with a three. They're making a few more threes this quarter, trying to cut into that deficit. Memphis has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Moran against Lillard. Outside Moran. No good on the shot. Johnson with the defensive effort. Portland has got three of five to fall from beyond the three-point line in the second. Over to the wing. 
Lillard outside. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Five-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Looking to get it going. Tipped. Three on three. Here's Johnson. Oh, that doesn't go on the chance to tie. Outside, Anderson. From deep three-point range. He got it up in time, but it would not fall for him. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Grizzlies out in front, leading by just two. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Thanks, guys. I'm joined with Coach Taylor Jenkins. What's the focus as you look forward to the second half? Just ignite our pace. You know, everything starts with our defense. Can we pick up our activity? We've got to get some stops. Got to keep them off the free throw line. You got to get out and run. They're showing a great crowd in the paint, but just trust the pass. Everyone's got to trust each other, get multiple actions, get some good looks, and hopefully they fall for us. High expectations for Coach. Appreciate it, Allie. And we'll be coming right back after this break, ready for the third quarter. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Big night so far for Steven Adams. He had 12 points, two assists, and one steal. Kenny, what'd you think about the Grizzlies? You have to love a team that pounds the offensive glass. That's going to gain you extra possessions. And check this out. Sometimes just having more offensive chances than your opponent wins the basketball. Looking at Portland, Shaq, your thoughts? Well, they've been getting worked on the glass. Out-hustled, out-muscled, out-bustled. Where's the fight? I know they got some tough matches down there, but if they really want to win the game, they need to crash the boards way harder in the second half. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been a fairly even one. What a game we're seeing from Damian Lillard. Through the first two quarters and change, his perimeter shooting continues to be spot on. What can you say? Shooting is a premium in this league, and you can see why. Portland has gone 6 of 14 from the perimeter tonight. Brooks and Anderson filling out the perimeter. Steven Adams out there with Brandon Clark. And it's Morant in at the 1. That's the 5 to begin the second half for Taylor Jenkins. It throws it down. And we know Lillard can score, but he's showing nice awareness with the pass to his open teammate. The Grizzlies shooting at about 44% so far. Brooks outside. And blocked. That one goes careening off the glass. And he comes up with a bucket. Anderson's got six points. I like the mid-range error for Anderson because of his size and because he makes good decisions with the ball in his hands. Now here's Lillard. On the wing, Bledsoe for the lead. Good. And it's Lillard who picks up the assist. Lillard's got five assists in the game. A hard-fought matchup. Seven lead changes thus far. And these teams have been sparring from the get-go. Neither able to land the knockout blow. Anderson with it. Winslow defending. Clark, the pass to Adams. Shot clock at six. And that one's good for Brooks. What we know about Dylan Brooks, he's a gamer. Three on the other end, right back at you. Bledsoe, right side. And again, it's Portland with a three. <laughs> They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Here's Brooks. Excellent D there from Ingles. For Portland, they've gone three of three in the second half. Pass to Bledsoe. The three. 
And Ingles gets it to go. The assist by Bledsoe. Bledsoe's got his sixth assist of the night. Moran against Lillard. Kicks it out to Anderson. And again, it's the Grizzlies from deep. Coming back with a three of his own, Kyle Anderson adjusts his game to rise to the level of competition. Brooks against Bledsoe. Pass to Ingles. Lillard outside. It's Winslow on the wing. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Winslow's got his first bucket in this one. And right now, that's five buckets in a row. Looking like a well-oiled machine coming out of the break. Memphis has gone two for two from deep here in the third. Morant, the pass to Clark. Moran against Ingles. Ooh, stolen by Winslow. Now the Blazers on the move. Pass to Lillard. Here he goes. And the layup is good off the glass. And now it's a five-point Portland lead. <laughs> and they've come out of halftime really on a roll. And the Grizzlies with possession here. And at home for the next one, it'll be Oklahoma City pulling in. That'll be the second and last game of a quick homestand. Here's Moran. Second shot opportunity. The shot no good. Now Portland takes it the other way. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Takes a three. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. And what's working here... Each guy is willing to make the next pass. Brooks, the pass to Adams. Pass to Moran. And Nurkic with the block. Showing off the timing and awareness defensively. Better think twice before challenging Nurkic. Defensively, it's hard to account for everything. They gambled off him, and it worked. And that's out of bounds. It was last touched by Bledsoe. And some changes here for the Grizzlies. Bain, he's checked in for Adams. Williams comes in for Anderson. And it's Jones in for Ja Moran. And also a switch here for Portland. Smith's checked in. Defense doesn't get much better than the mobile one block we just saw on replay. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages them to keep attacking on the offensive end. Now here's Jones. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. The ball's knocked loose. Brooks outside. Five on the clock. Pass to Jones. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. For the Trailblazers, Hart comes in for Ingles. And Simon has subbed in for Damian Lillard. Portland has got it going from the perimeter in the third. Four for four so far. Here's Smith. Pass to Nurkic. And Nurkic throws it down. And they're playing rock solid basketball right now. Really starting to see that lead grow. They have just nailed their halftime adjustments. That's for sure. They don't want to have to sweat this one out. They're looking to pull away. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. Thanks, Brian. Last season, Draymond Green called out what he saw as a double standard. When players ask for trades, they're vilified. But teams can announce they're planning to trade a player and sit him on the bench in the meantime. And then it's taken in stride. Guys, he feels like it's disrespectful. Well, that's something to consider, Ali. Thanks. Good stuff. One thing they've done well tonight, and that's rebounding. Here's Williams. And Nurkic with the block. And that's out of bounds. Memphis will retain possession. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Tillman's checked in. Timeout called. Memphis. There's no way Coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. Oh 
to the paint. Here's Jones. And Nurkic with the block. Here's Simons. And he dunks it down. Eyes up. Scanning the floor. Winslow plays with great poise and unselfishness. Now here's Jones. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Pass to Williams. Here's Clark, defended by Nurkic. And that one is stuffed right through. Playing from behind, it's amazing he chose a dunk with that high a difficulty rating. Yeah, no question. That was a stellar move with plenty of swagger. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages him to keep attacking on the offensive end. Back to Simons. Right side, Winslow. Four on the clock. The three, Smith. Jones grabs the board. Memphis has gotten six of 13 shots to go from outside the arc. Here's Bain. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Bain's got his second bucket on the night. And here's Portland. They're on a 17-7 run. Pass to Smith. Back to Simons. Down low. Here's Nurkic. And that one drops for him. Nurkic has got nine. It's going to take more effort than that to stop Nurkic from scoring. He's a tough-minded big who plays with physicality. Here's Jones. And he can't bank that one in. To me, there's a fine line between being aggressive and just flat-out forcing it. His inability to make shots right now is sinking the ship. Now here's Smith. Here's Nurkic. And the Blazers getting another bucket right there. And another great assist. The offense is really clicking now. Here's Jones. Pass to Bain. Again with the block. A defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Melton, he's checked in for Memphis. Little's checked in for Portland. Shot clock at three. Jones' his shot is good. That's nice work. Stopping short of the rim. Just laying it over the top. Well, Grant, the best way to steady a team, have an anchor like Tyus Jones as the backup point. I mean, just an outstanding decision maker. His steady play complements their athletes with that second unit. Here's Simons. Pass to Little. Hard with it. Little and the tip in on the offensive boards. And the Trailblazers lead by 12. Great effort to turn the miss into two points. Yes, sir. Those are the hustle points. Here's Tillman. Here's Bain. From 10 feet away, connects. The jumper drops. Bain's got four points now in the quarter. Portland has gotten four threes to fall out of five attempts here in the third. Pass to Little. Back to Smith. Here's Simons. Six on the shot clock. Oh, 
Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That one on Melton. Heady play to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line. All right, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Trailblazers. One thing that stood out all game is the consistent penetration they've gotten. Also, what touch they've displayed from long range as a team tonight and throughout this entire game. And he drops the first. And the Blazers making a change here. Johnson's checked in. Both good from the line that time. Memphis has gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. To the inside, Clark. And his fifth basket. Now five for eight. Looking comfortable out there. Man, he keeps doing his part. They just haven't been able to get over the hump. Pass to Little. Left side, Hart. Here's Little. And here's Hart. This one for three. Good D by Clark. Jones up top. Averaging around five points a game. Hey, no good. Well, Portland's shooting has been good. Around 52% from the field. Pass to Johnson. Here's Little. Clark covers. And now the Grizzlies on the run. Knocks it loose. It's stolen by Hart. Here's Johnson. Oh, and Johnson slams it in. <laughs> Talk about taking advantage of the opportunity. How about the anticipation right there that led to the steal? Then he goes straight to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. And it's the Grizzlies with the ball. Following the bucket by the Blazers. Pass to Tillman. Here's Bain. Now Jones. And Justice Winslow picks up the foul. That's foul number two for him. And the Grizzlies with some changes. Adams checked in for Bain. Anderson comes in for Clark. And it's Ja Morant in for Jones. Ingles, he's checked in for Portland. Lillard comes in for Simons. One nineteen left in the third quarter. To the middle. Here's Tillman. With the tip. It's good. On the putback. Adams has got 14. I love this game plan. That's 10 points in a row from in close. Lillard against Moran. Lillard outside. There's the steal. Melton with the ball. And Johnson picks him up defensively. He lobs it up to the rim. Melton passes to Moran. Another shot. Oh, he gets it to fall, and that makes it just a single-digit deficit. 13 points in the game. Portland leading. Lillard with the ball. He's got 24. Ingles passes to Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard. We've talked about it before. Unselfish, great awareness. Ingles willing to turn down the shot if someone can break free. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Melton on the wing. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make it a three-point play. Bledsoe, he's checked in for Hart. That'll be a five-second call. I don't get it. He was so efficient in the first half. Zero turnovers. But since the break, he's been a disaster. 
There's 25 seconds left in the third quarter. Now here's Moran. 13 points in the game. Six to shoot. From deep. Hits the trifecta. Morant's got five points in the quarter. Bread and butter play. Moran in screen and roll. He'll typically make you pay. The third quarter comes to a close. Trailblazers out in front. They're up by four. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back in a moment. Well, what a terrific game it's been so far. With this fourth quarter, sure to bring more pressure-packed basketball. Memphis has gone 7-14 of 14 from the perimeter in this one. And on the floor for Portland here in the fourth. They've got Eric Bledsoe. Johnson is out there with Joe Ingles. Then there's Damian Lillard. And it's Little in at the center, locking down the middle. Here's Little. Pass to Ingles. Stolen by Anderson. Nurkic just checked in for Portland. Outside Morant. Now Adams. Defended by Nurkic. The putback. Controls the rebound and the putback. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Bledsoe goes in. Oh, the bucket's good, and he'll have a chance at one more. That one on Melton. Look at what he's doing here, and it's hard to imagine him playing much better. And the Blazers making a change here. Hart's checked in. throw drops for Bledsoe for Memphis they've gotten just one shot to fall out of three attempts in the fourth Melton on the wing he's covered by Bledsoe outside Anderson and he drives in they get it back here's Brooks tries yet again it counts and the foul it goes on Josh Hart. This is all about effort on the glass. And they haven't had it. <laughs> What's up? And Adams no good on that one. Pass to Bledsoe. Stolen by Melton. And there's a whistle. That goes on DeAnthony Melton. That'll be foul number five on him. Just a little too aggressive. His fifth foul of the night. Expect them to go right at him to try to pick up number six. The Trailblazers shooting it with confidence. 54% so far. And it's Ja Morant with the foul. That'll be a second foul of the game. Oh, it's stolen by Adams. As the game has gone on, they've had trouble protecting the rock. Three-pointer, Brooks. Knocks it down from distance. It's a tie ball game. 
You can run these plays for Brooks. He's improving in the catch-and-shoot area. Boy, you love how guys are making plays for one another here. Yeah, just a balanced attack, a total team effort. Pass to Ingles. Up and over Brooks. And Ingles gets it to go. The assist by Lillard. Throughout the second half, they've achieved excellent efficiency on the offensive end. Morant, the pass to Brooks. Moran against Lillard. He blocks it again. Oh, you can't throw the weak sauce around him. No, you can't, B.A. I mean, he's sending everything back. Here's Adams. It falls, and now he's 10 of 15 shooting. Nice work. In the fourth quarter, he's gone three for four. They've really needed it. Lillard into the lane. The shot's good. Lillard's got 28. Yeah, it's not easy to try to knock Lillard off his equilibrium. So talented at scoring on the drive. For Memphis, they've gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. Morant, the pass to Brooks. Back to Morant. Floats one up, and he takes it up and lays it in. Man, I'll tell you, when you get your floater game going, it's a tremendous weapon. Pass to Nurkic. Right wing. Lillard against Moran. Shot clock at five. And Kyle Anderson is going to pick up the foul. That'll be a second foul of the game. Tillman's checked in for Melton. We're in the final quarter play here. Three minutes in. Pass to Lillard. Six on the shot clock. Back to Ingles. Good. And it's Lillard who picks up the assist. Lillard's got assist number eight now on the night. For Memphis, they've got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Lillard against Moran. On the wing, Brooks. Here's Adams. Soft touch off the glass. 22 points for him. A consistent hard worker. It's fun to see Steven Adams get his offensive game going. Bledsoe finds Nurkic. We played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Left side, Ingles. Trailblazers got to hurry. Got to get up a shot. Lillard can't get it to go. You wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the glass. Anderson against Hart. And Nurkic comes to help. Pass to Brooks. Now Morant. Memphis needs to get off a shot. Anderson for three. Offensive board. Here's Tillman. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. And the Grizzlies lead by two. It's winning time. And that's a winning play. Lillard into the lane. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Yeah, defensively, you think Lillard's going to hunt for the three ball. But then he puts it on the floor and just attacks. And now we get a little perspective here on how the hustle game has been for Memphis. They've been playing such pesky defense. It's been very impressive, especially all the turnovers they've caused. It also seems like they're taking a lot of pride in their rebounding tonight, especially offensively. First free throw is good. You know, it's the production plus the leadership that makes Lillard one of the most valuable players in this league. Both free throws good for Lillard. Productive trip to the line. He doesn't like to leave points on the table. Outside Morant. Fires at the elbow. Second chance shot. Anderson. 
And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. They're holding a big advantage in second chance points. Pass to Nurkic. Lillard with the ball, pounded by Moran. Already they're over the limit, and it's so early. This could turn into a load of free throws. First free throw is good. And both free throws good for Lillard. See, now he's getting defenders back on their heels a little bit. Getting to the foul line here in the second half. Lillard against Moran. Pass to Tillman. Adams with the ball. Now Brooks. Shot clock at six. That one a tad offline, but it drops in for him. Brooks has got five points now in the quarter. He's been so effective down the stretch, capitalizing on all his opportunities. Lillard against Moran. Lillard can't get it to go. Memphis has gone one for two from deep in this fourth quarter. Brooks against Bledsoe. Pass to Moran. Now here's Adams. Tries again. Ooh, tough break there. Shot after shot. They couldn't get anything to fall. Lillard into the lane. That one falls. Lillard's got 34 points. The tenacity from Lillard in the paint is exceptional. Not letting anyone throw him off his shot. Lillard against Moran. Outside, Anderson. Pass to Brooks. 4-3. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. Nurkic just got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. Offensive rebound. Here's Ingles. Oh, he misses the go-ahead basket. Well, Memphis shooting just around 45% on the fourth. To the paint. Here's Adams. Big props to Adams. This is a guy who brings the energy and effort every night. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw misses. Winslow's checked in for Hart. That one's no good. For Portland, they've gotten five shots out of nine to go in this fourth. Outside Winslow. Bledsoe outside. And there is the whistle. That goes on Damian Lillard. That'll be a second foul of the game. He's been a big factor in their offense tonight. Making shot after shot. Memphis trailing here. Time called here. The Grizzlies decide to talk it over. They're sending guys to the charity stripe way more than they should be. You'd like to see better positioning defensively. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Damian Lillard. 
This has been one of the most dominant performances I've ever seen. What's incredible is he has no off switch, just a tremendous motor, and he's making an impact on every single possession. And look at him. You think it's just another game. He is totally in control of his emotions. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Ali LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Taylor Jenkins had to say to his team. He told them, quote, it all comes down to the next few minutes. That's what will decide this game. So step up. This is your moment, not theirs. Inspiring words, guys. Thanks for that, Ali. It's stolen by Nurkic. Here's Ingles. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Bledsoe. After some misses in the first, he's making up for it now. Memphis has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. Here's Moran. Up again. Great positioning on the putback. Big man plays by Steven Adams. Using all of his height to dominate the offensive of glass and end the play. Now here's Bledsoe. Pass to Nurkic. And here's Lillard. Pocket four. Bledsoe. The pass to Lillard. And the rebound goes to the Grizzlies. Phenomenal how many threes he drained in the first half, especially considering he's hit none since. Offensive board. Adams pulls in another board. And he hauls in his 20th rebound. Oh, <laughs> just dominating the glass. They've been so active on the offensive glass. Those second chance points have really come in bunches. Nurkic passes to Lillard. Right side, Winslow. No good on the triple. This is the shot they wanted to get. Right guy, right spot, wrong result. And they recover it. With that offensive board, they're likely to have the last possession here. And they're giving up way too many second chance points. Lillard against Moran. It's Winslow on the wing. And that one's long. And you know they were praying for that one to go down. They could have tied it up. That was a huge opportunity they missed. Timeout called. Memphis. <laughs> and we'd all love to hear what goes on in those huddles. But we just get the snapshots. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. Lillard against Moran. Adams controls the rebound and the putback. And the Grizzlies lead by four. And it's their poor defensive rebounding that's really igniting this run. Lillard outside. Pass to Ingles. Down to five on the shot clock. Bledsoe with it. The shot to stop the run. Adams grabs the miss. Who is stolen by Lillard. Here's Nurkic. Back to Lillard. Here's Bledsoe. And Bledsoe with the slam. What makes Bledsoe such a good score? His speed keeps defenders on their toes. And he has the physicality to finish. Memphis has gotten one of three to fall from downtown here in the fourth. Brooks outside. 157 left in the game. And Nurkic with the block. Outside Winslow. Pass to Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard. It's game time. Whenever this team needs a big shot, he knows how to get one. There's a minute 40 left in the fourth quarter. Inside. Here's Adams. Drops in the layup for two. Adams has got 32 points. Emphatic bucket from Steven Adams. His team needed one and he wouldn't be denied. Lillard up top. Adams covering. Pass to Bledsoe. Oh, Brooks with the steal. 
broke loose. Stolen by Ingles. To the inside. And Lillard gets it to go on the assist from Nurkic. Lillard's got 38 points. Well, the Grizzlies shooting around 44%. Not bad. Morant with it. Nurkic picks him up. Outside for Brooks. Just five to shoot. They get it again. Outside, Anderson. Let's go with a three. Here's Adams. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That's on Justice Winslow. And you have to try to make something happen. I mean, they have to be aggressive at this point, even if it's risking a foul. Shooting two. He drops the first one, and that gives him a lead. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Clark's checked in. He's off on the free throw. Unable to get the second one to drop. Unfortunate that he missed one, but he still hit a crucial point there to help get his team the lead. Pass to Lillard. to take the lead the Grizzlies pull it in they've led by as much as 10 and now they foul and stop the clock yeah and that was a smart move I mean you have to foul right there you just don't want them to run out the clock and no good as the first free throw misses we'll see if he can hit the second we all know Kyle Anderson can do it all. Once he gets a little bit more consistent with this shot, watch out. And the second of two is good. And that'll put him up two. Timeout call. Portland. They're down by two. There's 18 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Guys, what do you think? More than enough time to get a bucket. But I'm curious to see, will they go for a two to tie or a three to win it all? Lillard against Moran. And here's Lillard. Pass to Bledsoe. To take the lead. And so the big win by Memphis in a tight game. What a performance they have here at home today. I'll tell you what. These are the ones that are so nice to win and so tough to lose. I love being on the edge of my seat, never knowing what would happen next. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Brandon, congratulations. You guys may have faltered a bit coming out of the gates, but you finished strong. Yeah, man, I mean, that's just us, really. Uh, you know, we're just always trying to feed off the energy. Uh, so it did kind of take a while there at the start, but once, once we uh, picked it up, it was all fine. The energy was there when it mattered the most. Strong finish. Thanks, Brandon. All right, Allie, thank you. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Steve Smith, Grant Hill, and Ali LaForce, I'm Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching this 2K Sports coverage of the NBA. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.